Hello everyone, this is Wingblaze one and this is Let's Play Legend of the Mystical Ninja. Currently, we are in part 2 now, and we are in the Horror Temple, searching for the Ghost Woman of the Temple. So now we have these little uh, flames that come out of these lanterns and turn to take us, and in the background right there, actually, you can see the uh, Hitodama. Those are more or less spirits of the newly dead, uh, which have taken on a wisp-like appearance, I guess you could say. Within Japanese mythology, those are pretty common depictions, really. Throw a coin at him. And now we just hit that bell there, and there you go. Simple. Now, uh, now, of course, you notice we're in a side-scrolling area now. So, now you can hit down, actually, and he'll go into a kind of a crawl-ing mode. And if you left or right, push left or right, he does the worm, actually. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> Ah, Karakasa Obake. Those are basically, uh, umbrellas, like, old umbrellas which have gained, uh, which have become enchanted, or, well, I guess gained a soul, actually. Uh, they're a type of Tsukumogame, Tsukumogame, within, which is within Japanese mythology, basically items that have been reach like a hundred years in age, they gain, actually gain, uh, they become enchanted with spiritual powers and begin to move around on their own, you know, and these are Karakasa Obake, which are umbrellas pretty much, but there's other, one, other ones like sandals and uh, lanterns and things like that. And that elephant statue actually acts as a checkpoint. Ah, dang. Dang. Yeah, see, I just got saved by the pizza there, due to my stupidity and trying to make that jump. Uh, once your health bottoms out, that pizza will, he'll eat it and he'll regain some health. Alright, boss time. And here is the ghost woman of the temple. Now, basically, what you just got to do here is reflect these dis discs back at her. There we go. Pretty easy, all things considered. You know, Ninja Cat. Awesome. Kurobe. Hurry to Shikoku Island. Go see the cat boss, Coben. And we got a cool hundred for defeating that boss there. Pretty nice. Okay, now, if you go in here, now that we can actually get in here, there is a maze, which 
you can walk around and and pick up items, but it, you know it's one of those first person mazes, and I just really don't feel like doing it. I'm just not gonna waste my time. But but that's there for you if you want to do it. Just cause I, I I just hate those kind of mazes. I will, however, go in here and refill my health. We can also access this building we couldn't before, and inside, you can actually play some mini games where, uh, you just take, got, have a chance to earn some cash. This top one's basically whack a mole, and this bottom one, I think, if I remember correctly, you try and throw balls at, uh, goblins. And this one, basically, you just, uh, try and paint this canvas here. You can't cross any of the lines or go outside the the lines really it's actually pretty simple and yeah I already screwed up but I mean, made, made 120. It was only what, um, I think like 80 to play. So I, so I got 40 out of that. Not bad. Okay. So now, let's just duck in the store real quick. And since I used some pizza, I'm gonna get some more of that. And I'll get some sandals, too. I'm gonna pick up some more bombs real quick. Alright. Go away, fish. I don't like you. Hate you. Now we can actually get into this building that was that said was closed earlier, and you can play a mini game. Or yeah, basically you throw dice and guess what the total is gonna be, and you bet. But you know, I I really don't care right now. I'm just not gonna do it right now. Where we are actually supposed to go is inside here. This building right here. And this is the travel center. Oedo Travel Agency. Tour to Chicago. Yes! Oh, uh, wh whoops. I'm really not sure what the difference is. No tour guy. Oh, ha! Basically, you just have to. That's kind of funny, and I'll, I'll show you some of these other ones as well. Uh, at the uh, if you choose, basically the the 200. You get an increase of life energy, as well as a tour guide, which I'm I'm not sure if the tour guide actually does anything or not, but 
Huh. Good dang, Dr. Yang. Leave for Cocoa Island to meet Colbin, the cat boss. Awesome. And now, Zone 2, Statue of Cat. Alright. So, now we're into Zone 2, and I'm just about out of time in this video, so we'll start this up next video. Alright. Join me next time. This is Wingblaze1, and this is Let's Play Mystical Ninja.